At first glance, opponents might not think this lanky Lebanon, Oregon native would be an imposing figure on the golf course. But throughout Ken Forster's long amateur golf career, he has been all of that and more. Quietly pursuing golf excellence with constant practice and a humble nature that has endeared him to all who know him, Forster has built an impressive record of accomplishment over the years, especially more recently in the senior amateur ranks. He didn't take up the game until he was 15, but he would soon master it. As a collegiate golfer, Ken earned NAIA First Team All-American Honors in 1969. Like many young golfers committed to his family and career, Ken largely confined his tournament play to the Salem area, much to the chagrin of the local amateurs. In 1990, now in his mid-40s, the Sprague High School history and economics teacher began to school his opponents. Ken emerged victorious in the OGA Tournament of Champions and again later in the Oregon Mid-Amateur Championship. In the spring of 1994, Ken entered the senior amateur ranks and he's been a dominant force since. He's captured the Portland Senior City Amateur Championship five times and the Oregon Senior Stroke Play Championship twice in 1994 and 1997. Even though he's now a senior, Ken could not help himself from beating up on the youngsters. In 1995, he came oh so close to capturing the PNGA Master 40 title before Bellingham lefty Fred Urquhart narrowly defeated him at British Columbia's Kilchina Golf and Country Club. In 1998, Forster qualified for the United States Senior Open at the venerable Riviera Country Club in the Los Angeles area. Ken kept the momentum going the following year by hoisting the Oregon Senior Open Championship as the senior professionals were now falling victim to this unassuming upstart amateur. As a result of his play in the U.S. Senior Open, he was afforded the opportunity to play in the British Senior Open at Royal County Down in Ireland, one of the most revered and difficult Lynx courses in the world. With rounds of 77, 72, 70, and 75, Ken finished as low amateur quite an accomplishment for the skinny kid from Salem. With all of this professional and international experience now under his belt, Ken was ready to dominate the Northwest senior golf scene. Most notably, he would earn back-to-back-to-back -to -back -to -back PNGA senior amateur wins, a rare three-peat he considers one of his most satisfying accomplishments. In recent years, Ken has also become well acquainted with the United States Golf Association, having played in five U.S. Senior Amateur Championships and advancing to the quarterfinals on three occasions. Along the way, Ken has earned two PNGA Senior Amateur Player of the Year awards and has been named to a Hudson Cup team a whopping 12 times. And he still hasn't let up on his Northwest professional brethren during the Hudson Cup matches as they have voted him the recipient of the prestigious Bill Eggers Award three times as the MVP of the senior amateur team. A fine champion, Ken has also been a great friend, especially to his longtime home club, Illahee Hills Country Club in Salem, as well as mentor to many young golfers. He had a 29-year run as a high school golf coach in the Salem area before retiring from teaching in 1999 and impacted many young lives as a result. For being a fine champion, mentor, true gentleman golfer, and friend of the game in every respect, the PNGA honors Ken Forster tonight with induction into the Pacific Northwest Golf Hall of Fame. Congratulations, Ken.